An Ibizan hound is a hound dog that originated from the Balearic Islands off the Mediterranean coast. They were initially used to help hunt rabbits about 3,000 years ago by Phoenician traders. The Phoenician traders brought hounds to the island from Egypt to assist with catching food. Ibizans can make an exceptional family pet. They are friendly, silly, and family-oriented. Ibizans may be wire-haired or smooth-haired. Wire-haired Ibizans are less common than their smooth-haired counterparts. The coat of an Ibizan is red and white with light tan noses, ears, rims around the eyes, and pads on the feed. The breed has a very athletic-looking build and easily recognizable upright ears. They have a long neck and a long and narrower head. Learning about some of the common health issues Ibizans face is important if you are looking to bring one of these dogs home to your family. Not all Ibizans will suffer from all, or any, of these conditions. But when you know what to look for, it can help you catch a potential problem early before it evolves into a bigger problem. Some Ibizans may develop autoimmune thyroiditis, which can lead to hypothyroidism. Most dogs that are going to develop this problem will do so between the ages of 2 and 5. Hypothyroidism can cause a dog to be very lethargic and weak, gain weight, become intolerant of the cod, and develop a dull and dry coat. Ibizans may also develop hip dysplasia, which is a genetic condition. Hip dysplasia occurs when a dog's joints doing form properly and the bones begin to rub against one another. This can be very painful and may require surgery. You should also be on the lookout for signs of bloat in your dog. Bloat is when a dog's stomach becomes enlarged and filled with air, food, or fluid. The stomach twists and the dog is unable to relieve any gas. It can cause them to have trouble breathing. If you suspect your dog has bloat, formerly known as gastric dilation volvulus, seek medical attention right away as this is a life-threatening problem. In summary, some of the potential health concerns faced by Ibizans include autoimmune thyroiditis and hypothyroidism hip dysplasia bloat Ibizan hounds have a very even-tempered personality. They are very family-oriented and enjoy spending time with and entertaining the people in their family. This breed is very intelligent and is good at solving problems. Overall Ibizan hounds respond well to positive training methods, but they have a bit of a personality mix and can exhibit stubborn or independent traits and behaviors as well. Ibizan hounds are a very active breed and require regular exercise. However, they can also be a good house pet, as long as their activity need is met. The prey drive for an Ibizan hound is very high, so it is always important to keep him on a leash when you go for a walk and make sure your backyard has a high and secure fence. Most Ibizans will need between two and three cups of high-quality dog food from a respected manufacturer. The exact amount that is right for each dog will vary based on their activity level, age, weight, metabolism, health concern, and other factors. An Ibizan should eat twice a day, so split the recommended amount of food into two daily servings. Some owners feed their Ibizan kibble, others choose a raw or home-cooked diet, and still, others choose some mix of the three. The choice is up to you, but you can contact your vet if you're looking for guidance or suggestions. Ibizan puppies should be fed a high-quality puppy formula. Your dog's vet will also be a good resource if you're not sure which type of food is best for them. Keep in mind that young puppies have a small stomach, so they won't be able to eat as much food at one time. For this reason, you'll need to split their food into three or four servings throughout the day. Once a puppy is six months, just two servings of food should be sufficient each day. Ibizans may have a wire-haired or straight-haired coat. You'll want to brush and bathe your Ibizan periodically when it looks or smells like they need it.
This goes for both wire-haired and short-haired dogs. In addition to brushing and bathing your Ibizan, they'll also need to have their teeth brushed regularly and their nails clipped to prevent them from getting too long and painful to walk on. Positive reinforcement training methods work best for Ibizans. Keep your training sessions shorter and interesting to keep your dog's attention. While the breed is quite intelligent, they also get bored very easily. You should also crate train your Ibizan since house training can be a challenge with the breed. Ibizans need a lot of physical activity. They are a very athletic breed. They have been known to jump up to 5 or 6 feet into the air, so you'll also want to ensure you have a fenced-in backyard. Each day, your dog will need to take a few long walks and or engage in a game with you or another member of the family in the backyard. Once you bring an Ibizan puppy home, you'll want to start the process of socialization as soon as possible. This will help them get used to lots of different people, pets, and places and can help them adjust to different situations in the future. You will also want to begin potty training and training your new dog to get them used to your routines and expectations. Before purchasing a puppy from a breeder, ask for health clearances for the parents to help decrease the chances that your dog will inherit a genetic condition such as hip or elbow dysplasia, von Willebrand's disease, hypothyroidism, or eye diseases.